Hi everyone, it's Tracy, and today we're talking about the top five things you need to do when you're going through and dividing your assets in family law matters. So to start with, I just want to let you know I could give you a hell of a lot more than just top five things, but I've got to limit it down to five, otherwise we'll be here for forever. So today we're going to talk about episode number one being the difference between divorce and property settlement and what they actually mean. It's really important you actually get that definition down. So divorce is solely for you to go and get remarried and be able to actually terminate your marriage. It has absolutely nothing to do with dividing up your assets or your debts. So that's a different process altogether. Property settlement is what you understand as dividing your assets. It is not a property as in just a house. It is all of your assets and it's dividing all of your assets and your debts. That is the process that we call property settlement. So it's really important you understand those two things because if you ever head into a family court, you're never going to hear, oh, I'm here to divide my assets. You're going to hear the term property settlement. So I hope that that has been helpful. That's episode number one in the top five things you should know in a property settlement matter. I look forward to seeing you for episode number two when we're going to actually talk about time limits and when you should go through this process. I'll see you then.